Hi folks, and welcome to the video tutorial for Jackson's song. So this song is capoed on the 7th fret, um, and like with the other songs where we have a capo, we sort of reset the guitar, so for example this I will call a G, even though it's not actually a G. Um, so there's a little riff uh, that opens the song, and rather than trying to call out all the individual little notes, I figured it might be helpful to just have a close-up of my fingers so you can kind of see what's going on and eventually uh, pick it out. So, um, as with a lot of the other songs, I'm always using my thumb in the bass on my right hand, and my other little fingers are picking out, kind of like little claws, the notes as they go by. So I'll just play that, that intro part for you and get a sense of how it goes. little things that... So there's a lot of little hammer-ons and little slides. And right here, I hit that A string. Um, so yeah, hopefully you can sort of pick that up just by um, listening along and, and looking at the, the close-up shot of the fingers. I'll play it one more time so you can just follow along and I'll do it a little bit slower. So. And it's always a really good idea to practice something slowly, and then once you master it, then you can pick it up in speed. Um, and then the verses, uh, it's more simple. It just goes like this. G, D with an F sharp in the bass. I'm hitting the B, but still playing a D. A. F sharp, G, A. My guitar keeps buzzing. It needs a bit of a tune-up. But one thing you might have noticed is that I've switched from uh, switched guitars, and that's because this guitar here has a cutaway. And when you're playing that high up on the neck, it's much easier if you have a cutaway. If you don't have a cutaway, you can still do it, but it's pretty hard. So you might want to knock it down a few notches on the capo, and you'll have an easier time getting those higher notes. Uh, anyway, so the verse goes, uh, Well now, Jackson, how have you been? What kind of action have you been getting in? And it's kind of a, with my right hand, it's kind of a mix of strumming and a little bit of finger picking. which is G, A, D, G, G, A, B minor 7, G, A, D, G, A, back to that picking pattern. And then the next uh, set of verses are the same as before. G, D with an F sharp in the bass. G, hitting that B, A major, G, D with the F sharp in the bass. 
And the only other difference is going to the second chorus, I just hold that G for a little extra bar, and the chorus has one extra pass, um, but there's no change to the chords. So there you go. That's how you play Jackson's song. It ends with the, the same way that it starts. So hopefully you can uh, figure that out. And um, yeah, thanks for watching the tutorials. Take care. Chad.